Yo guys, welcome back to the channel. So, uh, today's video, I would actually like to talk about the new battle pass that's coming out for Operation uh, Void Edge. Now, we didn't really know much about this battle pass before. Uh, we, we knew that we were going to get one during Void Edge, but we didn't really have any uh, knowledge on the cosmetics that were coming with it, uh, the theme of it, and stuff like that. But, um, the other day when Operation Void Edge released, we actually got a trailer for all the new things coming in Void Edge. And one of the things in it, which I didn't realise and I don't think a lot of people have, is they actually gave like a sneak peek of the battle pass. So I'm just going to show this here real quick and then uh, we'll go talk about it. So I'll see you guys after this little bit. So, as we just seen, uh, the theme for this next battle pass is going to be around the world. So, it's just going to be based on different locations and places, I guess. Um, probably, it's going to reference like uh, the places that um, the operators are from and just uh, be around that sort of topic, I guess. Um, as you can see at the beginning here, we actually have some pretty cool art of Buck, Ash and Dokubi. And they're kind of like the skins that we'll be getting. So the skins that we actually seen was a full new Dokubi set, which she seems to be in like some sort of snow ski gear, which is pretty cool. Um, another thing we got to see is a new Buck bundle, and um, this was actually leaked a while ago, and I believe this is actually a legendary set for Buck. So that actually seems pretty cool, seems like one of the better ones, because uh, mechs for Bucks, even though I'm pretty sure we are getting Elite skin soon. Uh, we also seem to have some really cool cosmetics for Castle. And this seems to be very Night Haven themed. So, for you guys that don't know, Night Haven is the it's a corporation that Callie and Wamai are from, and it's like a private military. And we do know that in the story right now for Siege, uh, Night Haven actually do have a very big part, and they will actually be uh, we'll be getting another operator from Night Haven, which will be coming in season three of Year Five. So Night Haven seems to be a really big part of this and it looks like we're going to be getting more Night Haven skins just like we did in the packs. Um, we'll also be getting a new Ash skin and this seems to be like the one from the loading screen or the background from the 6 Invitational event where she is in her boxing gear and it's the one where her and Castle were in boxing gear. So it seems like we'll be getting that as a skin which is actually really cool because that seems like a really cool skin. And the final skin that we get to see here is a new Valkyrie one, and she looks very cool. She's got like her hair messy, she has like this really cool sit on. She seems to be like rocking more of like a, like a Yan, uh, a Yan, Yana, 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 looking more like Yana than she does Valkyrie, so that's a really cool skin. So these seem to be some or all the skins that we get getting in the next battle pass um just like the last one it will be 35 tiers and 1200 um or six credits to buy the premium pass but i'm pretty sure that is around 800 if you have the year pass so it's cheaper if you have the year pass and um yeah so i'm pretty sure that'll be all like the uniforms and headgears but we will be getting charms and weapon skins as well as that so uh that's all we really know so far about the next battle pass um, it does actually seem quite cool in my opinion. Uh, let me know your thoughts in the comments below about what you think of these skins and you think this battle pass is going to be worth it. And um, yeah, another thing actually I just remembered is uh, apparently the battle pass is going to have a lot of story implementations in it as well. And I don't know how they're going to do that. Maybe it'll have like dialogue or just like written bios and stuff. But they did say that the battle passes are going to have a lot of story aspects to them. So um, that's quite interesting to see. So, uh, that's going to end this video here. Uh, if you did enjoy it, be sure to drop a like. And like I said, leave your thoughts in the comments below. And um, yeah, thank you guys for watching. See you in the next video.